Hi guys, this is a new vlog. Um, I have so many video ideas, but I was sitting here and I was like, why don't I vlog? Ignore this. <laughs> I was like, why don't I vlog? It's a Tuesday, I'm at home. Um, been on my um, Instagram coming up with new ideas for the business. My phone is charging and I thought it's time that I get influencers for my t-shirt business. So basically I've made stories and asked my followers to um, suggest influencers. So yeah, I think you guys can also suggest in this video actually. Even if I've already selected from Instagram, I'm open to getting suggestions from this video. So I'm looking out for influencers who love wearing t-shirts <laughs> and also who um, do fashion content, preferably. But I'm definitely open because everyone wears clothes. Every once in a while, someone wears a t-shirt. So yeah. Otherwise, welcome to this vlog. Um, it's just just going to take you guys along with me in my week. There's some um, training that I saw on Instagram um, that will be hosted by Tessa and some other company I've forgotten. And so I sent in my application yesterday and they're supposed to have a in-person training, something like that, on 7th which is Thursday, so I applied and put my phone number, so I'm hoping they can call me and confirm, and I can go for that. This year I want to try and um, put myself in uncomfortable places, and just put myself out there. Um, so this training is about um, selling your knowledge. So I did an e-guide, if you don't know about that, the information will be in the description box. I did an e-guide um, teaching people how to start a breast jewelry business from scratch because I did this for around three years. But then I stopped, I closed that business and started the one of teeth. So yeah, we shall see how that goes. I hope it happens. I would love to sit in a room and with professionals I just learn how to sell my knowledge, structure the course and all these. It's an e-guide with around eight chapters. So if I'm with professionals, I'm sure they would help me identify maybe things I left out, clean it up and all that. Anyway, it's a midday and I need to be eating breakfast. So let me get breakfast. So, this is my breakfast, brown bread with avocado, sprinkled on some salt, some fluffy mandazis, and coffee. What I've shown you, what I've shown you is my basic breakfast, let me stand here, my basic breakfast, brown bread, and I'll eat it in different ways. The avocado is so nice. I didn't toast the bread. It's late and I need to unfast my 16 hour fast. So yeah, let me eat. It is around midday. Um, this is my lunch. Spaghetti, peas and broccoli. It's delicious. Finally taking a shower. This is me. <laughs> yeah, and I'm watching. This is what I'm watching. I feel this thing of phones here and actually here has yesterday Prim posted she was in India. On my Instagram, I got one new Indian follower. <laughs> Netflix recommended this to me. It's about to start recommending Indian destinations to travel to <laughs> Hi people Losing weight eh? 
<laughs> in Africa specifically. Until they get done, there will be no rest. <laughs> anyway, um, I'm just chilling. Some has gone outside to play. He has gone out with ourselves. I'm mean, in the house alone. So he has gone to work. Uh, It's given what it's supposed to give. <laughs> That's why on this weight loss journey, I haven't like restricted myself. Yes, I try to eat healthy, but I'm like, you know what? I'm still young. I don't have any health issues. Let me eat, but in moderate quantities. And also keep active. That I've been able to lose all that weight. I mean, but well, I haven't even shared this secret. <laughs> you see, I've been sharing posts that I'm losing weight. What, 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 what? Clothes are beginning to fit me. You know how many kilograms I've lost? When I checked after, I think they were like six weeks, I had lost one kilogram, you guys. Sorry, two kilograms. <laughs> So at this point of week 10, hopefully I've lost 4 kgs. 4 or 3. Like in total. And right now, it's 6 pm and um, my eating window closes at 8. So, enjoyment. Guys, so I planned I have to want to do a YouTube video. I sit down today, but I'm so lazy. But I have to do it. I've written down the major points. So let me go and dress up, make myself look a bit presentable, and do that. I think this video is going to come after that one because I sit down is so easy to edit. Now these vlogs we have. 15 different videos so yeah I'm doing the video that's going to be uploaded on the today is 5th Tuesday 7th huh? Four. it's going to be uploaded on the day before women's day 7th <laughs> so yeah let me go and do that now I feel so lazy but what have I done today? Barely anything. So let me do that. Just to have the mental satisfaction that I did something constructive. I have finished um, doing the story time video. So that's going to go up on 7th as I had said. I had changed into this card dress. I'm changing back into makeup then. I'd put Kali Balm. I was wearing a cap. I was in. I'm a new person. I am a new being. I know I didn't fit. I literally have to tie the cape on my head. Anyway, you'll see the photos on my Instagram page. I am done filming. Um, actually, if you guys have any video suggestions, anything you'd want me to do, please let me know because I feel like I'm running out of videos. My vlogs are in the house. I don't really leave the house that much, but I am hoping I will be braver and start making content when I'm outside the house. But yeah, let me end this for today and we shall continue tomorrow. See ya. <laughs> Hi guys, it is Wednesday morning. I'm dropping some of at school. It's past eight. Immediately out of bed, getting ready to bring this one. I'm so overwhelmed. My body is shocked. I just woke up. To... 
me, let me take this one inside. As you can see, I'm packed outside. There's school, you have to sign in, walk in with the kids, and he's always crying. Let's see today if you cry. You guys, he cried as usual. Like, he can never let me just drop him off in peace. He always has to cry. I don't know what's mm. up. And all the kids have stopped crying. It's just sad. <laughs> anyway, it will be okay. You will have to just learn the fact. Have we done a month? Oh my god. Today is a month since he started at this school. So, it's okay. So learn. If it takes the full time, if it takes the full year, what can we do? <laughs> you know, let me go back home and work out. Mm -hmm. I guess I've just finished my workout for the day. Week 10, day 3 out of 5. Done. Did you work out today? Did you work out on Thursday? Thursday 6. The one. Did you? <sighs> I've gotten so used to doing this. My body, I'm always thinking, what time will I start working out? What time will I start working out? Because I've made it a part of my routine and I'm so proud of myself. Let me now start the day officially. Okay, so this is my breakfast. Brown bread instead of put lettuce, tomato and um, mayonnaise. Some remaining corn cracks. This is hard corn with chili, very yummy. And some coffee, black coffee, no sugar. Guys, guess what? Embarrassment. Okay, not so bad, but I'm embarrassed. The meeting is for next week. Um, hi people. I'm in the middle of um, editing the vlog and I've just realized I did not give context <laughs> of what I'm talking about. I thought I did a video but I have failed to trace it. So this is me trying to give context. Um, we're supposed to have a meeting at some school. It is supposed to be this week. Okay, in regards to the video, it was supposed to be the following week, but me, I went a week before. So that is me coming from his school, embarrassed after going on the wrong day, in the wrong week. Like, what the hell? <laughs> anyway, yeah, continue watching the video. And something kept telling me, check the email. I'm like, now I'm sure. <laughs> Even when I reach the school, I'm like, why don't I check the email before I enter? I'm like, nah, please tell me where I reached. Like, there was no even vibe of meetings. I'm like, it may be because we all booked different times. That's why there's no meeting vibe, but it's okay. Oh my god, Twitter has changed. Like, it's next week. I was so embarrassed. So, yeah. I got showered and dressed earlier than ideally I would, but it's okay. It is okay. Because at least now I don't have to take that off my showering and all that. Yeah, but guys, this heat. And this car doesn't have any working AC. Also, the school is literally two minutes away, so it's okay. I didn't have to move anything around, so that's how you effectively console yourself. So let me get back in the house and chill. Huh? Okay, I'll see you guys in a bit. Hey guys, it's Thursday. I said we didn't see you well. What's wrong? 
What's wrong? Mr. Ditsa, I'm got a temperature. Yes, a cold and a cough, which I think caused the temperature. The temperature was so high in the night. Definitely, I didn't sleep so well. I brought him into our bed, slept with him, slept. I kept waking up to check on him. I kept having to tap it, sponge him. And just keep monitoring to see if his temperature went down. It finally went down after felt like after what felt like a long time. But the temperature finally went down. He was breathing well. You know, at some point he was as if wheezing. He wasn't breathing well because of the cough. Oh my god. But he thank God he ended up sleeping and he also slept. And yeah, I woke up this morning just feeling super exhausted. So the time I would have been working out, I went back to bed. I woke up, gave him breakfast, left him with the house help to monitor him, and I had to go back and sleep. I was so exhausted, my back was hurting, because at some point I sat up and carried him, just out of fear. <laughs> I carried him, so I think that's what caused my back ache. We sat, and I was carrying him for like an hour, so oh my god, it's not been easy. But I'm dressed for my workout. So I think I'm now I'm, I think I'm going to skip and that will be my workout for the day. I've been following a workout routine on YouTube but I think I'll let that go today. Let me do the skips and I'll come back here and show you guys my after. And I'm done skipping and I'm sweating. Man, that sweating thing, it really validates you after you've worked out. You don't feel like you wasted time. Though not everyone sweats, but it's really validating. <laughs> so yeah, let me go and work out. Hi people, I've just finished the skips. Kalito, 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 ka sweats spread around. So anyway, on my... What did I post? Today on my Instagram stories. And then some jig out of the blue came and began <laughs> social media, social media. Just think I haven't. Oh yeah, 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 I posted a story time. Posted a story time today of where I left for my employment. I was like, I'm not telling the full story. What? It's because I'm privileged that I was able to leave my job. You guys watch my YouTube channels. And my YouTube channels, my YouTube videos. I'm in the struggle, but you know when people don't see you struggling, they are pressed. She's probably just seeing me on Instagram and she's like, this chick must be living that dream. I don't know though what dream. Maybe her dream is to stay home every day, create content, think of content ideas, record videos, sell t-shirts like me. She thinks that what I post, I think, on Instagram is my whole life and so happy as it's so. <laughs> so she's so sad that I'm happy and I'm not showing people the sad part. Then look for channels that say my sad life, then you can follow them and then you feel the validation you need. The validation that that person is not suffering, that you are not suffering alone, there are other people who are suffering like you or even more than you. It's so funny. <laughs> it's literally happened today. Like, I take a man to my story as to where I left my job and it didn't have to be a problem. What? <laughs> the internet is such a fun place. <laughs> and I'm going to finish my 300 skips. I'm on my weight loss struggle. Keeping fit struggle. The struggle to create healthy habits. Is not a struggle enough. I have to come and post you guys. We didn't have food today. <laughs> Please send us money, you guys. We don't have electricity. We don't have water. <laughs> We've been set out of the apartment. Vlog how to live in your car. Vlog. We are being just out of our apartment, as I show you guys, when we are getting out and crying and we have nowhere to go. I'm sure there are channels like that. Look for them, sis. Look for them. 
let me continue with my happy life full of privilege hi guys today is 8th march women's day i've just finished my workout i've been carrying weights and i'm making my hands work again oh my god anyway i think i'll end the vlog today i'll take you guys through my day here and there River, whenever i can remember but anyway today is a friday women's day 8th march 2024 um i finished my workout for that day day five out of five week week 10 week 10 i'm so proud of myself can we finish week 11 week 12 what if we get to week 52 that would be a whole year of workouts <laughs> anyway whew, let me catch my breath and drink some water i'll see you guys in a bit hi guys i hope you can hear me over the coco melon so i have these piercings those two on my ear and this one i want to this one has been crying but it's being dramatic I'm trying to remove them to put others, but these were screws, eh? they're not easy to remove. I've been trying to unscrew this and the other cartilage, but the hassle is real. Let me keep trying, pray for me. <laughs> I feel like my nose is healed, but I still feel pain when the capin comes out. Is that normal? <laughs> Sam. <laughs> As I was still saying, um, okay, sorry, sorry. As I was still saying, how do you know that your nose pin has actually healed? Sorry, how do you know your nose pin has actually healed? Is it when you stop getting double pimples or when you stop feeling pain completely? Because generally, it doesn't hasn't like a blade or anything in a really long time but once in a while when it will accidentally like slide up i feel the mother of all pains so let me know if you have a nose piercing is it safe for me to remove it for context i've had it now for over a year i made the last chair in october so let me know so I've been trying to remove these pins for that I think. I think I've done an hour. I've tried this, this, and this. This is the only one that I can just pop out. Please share some hacks. Actually, let me go on TikTok and see if there are any hacks. I really, 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 really want to switch them out. Just even get them clean. They've been there for a minute. Hi guys. Um, it's now Monday of the following week. I thought I'd put little Vaseline, but my lips are now <laughs> glowing. Anyway, I've come here to end the vlog. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, I talked about several things. One of them was doing the going for the training for Tessa. It was actually postponed, so we booked for a one-on-one -on -one session for next week wednesday which will be my birthday i'm so excited to do something productive on my birthday not just enjoyments um what else did i tell you guys about sam's meeting which i went for by mistake last week is now this week on wednesday 13th um what else what else did i want to update you guys on i remember sam was sick he's still sick we are now in the new week. I'm also sick. I got the cold last night, Sunday night. I blacked out. I was so weak, so sick. Even some were so sick. I had no idea. He slept so badly. Thank God his dad was around. Yeah, so anyway, today morning we both went to hospital. I'm feeling a bit better. So is Sam. He was so, so affected by not sleeping well last night that when we came back home, like at 11 a.m., he slept 
which has never happened. So I'm sleeping in the middle of the day. He always sleeps after lunch or like at midday. He slept between 10 and 11 till like 1 p.m. So that shows how sick he was. Definitely he didn't go to school. I don't know if he'll go tomorrow. We shall see. But yeah. Also, I ordered for teas. They reached in Uganda. I need to collect my coins, pay for them, so I can have them delivered from the courier. Um, yeah, I think that's all. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you enjoyed it, please subscribe. We are at 900 subscribers, and I hope by the end of this month we'll be at 1K. Very big dreams, but you never know so yeah thank you guys for watching and i'll see you in the next video bye